Hi everyone, it's me, Darlene. It is Saturday, a beautiful gray Saturday for those of us who belong to the Gray Day Club. Hey, I just made that up. I know there are some of you out there like me who prefer gray over sunshine. And it is gray and it is cooler today, so I'm told. I have not even stepped outside yet. So the first thing I thought is, oh, I should go to the graveyard. But today I'm just not in the mood for that. I would have been in the mood mentally and physically yesterday, but it was just too hot and humid. Today, I just feel like staying home, and I thought, perfect time to go through my junk drawer, which is not so much a junk drawer as it is like a storage drawer for utensils that we rarely use, and it, I ended up just throwing all kinds of junk in there. So I guess it's officially a junk drawer. So let me go get it so I can show it to you. Okay. Getting that drawer out is not going to be an easy task, so I can't do it right now. I have three, like, three drawer cabinets in what used to be the laundry area, and the only way I can open that drawer fully and take it out is I have to take the middle cabinet out, slide that end cabinet over into the middle, pull out the drawer, and there's just junk on top of them, so I guess this probably wasn't as good of an idea as I thought, but now that I said I'd do it, I'll do it. And maybe I can clean the other drawers too. Not today, not today. I also have to do laundry and dishes. And I thought maybe while I'm doing my junk drawer video, recording that, I can force myself to do those other little tasks during breaks and stuff. So um, I am feeling better today. I'm gonna tell you guys that after I did my um, deep and emotional childhood drinking video the other night, I felt kind of weird for the past couple days after that because even though I only tell you little bits and pieces, it's like I, I relive a lot of stuff and I mean I was almost like really regretted that I did that video because I thought I'm not going to feel like doing YouTube anymore. I just felt like, I just felt, um, I don't know. I don't know how I felt, but I didn't feel creative at all. So I just kept saying I'm going to just take some time and just, you know, go through the emotions because to me, even bad emotions or bad feelings or feeling depressed, that is good because when you suffer depression, the worst thing you can possibly feel, for me at least, is when I feel nothing. The feeling of nothing is the most scary because you just feel nothing. So I felt sad and depressed and very nervous and anxious. So I, I had all those good feelings. Those are good feelings for me because they are feelings. I like all feelings. Good, good, good ones. The not so good ones, they're all, they're all good for me. And I have heard other people who suffer from depression say the same thing, that any feeling is a, is a good feeling and a good sign. It's like my serotonin levels are at least letting me um, feel. <laughs> I don't even know what night I posted that video, but yeah, I, I struggled for a couple of days, just, you know, second guessing myself and then, you know, just feeling things that are uncomfortable yet good. And, um, and then the other thing I struggle with is, is, uh, how, I don't know, I don't know how to say it without sounding, because I don't know how to say anything without sounding mean or rude or I don't know how to express myself very well because I've not had a lot of practice with that. But um, I'm a little bit more um, timid about looking at comments because I just never know what a comment is going to, you know, say and if it jumps out at me and, I, you know, I take it so hard or, or I don't know how to reply and you know there is going to be a time I hope there is a time that I won't be able to look at all the comments because hopefully my channel will be so huge that it would be impossible for me to answer or even read all the comments but at this point I certainly can read all the comments you know on the videos that are very emotional for me I I might just like look at them and not answer. I guess what I'm trying to say is if I do not reply to your comment, don't take that personally. It doesn't mean I didn't like what you said. It doesn't even mean that I read it. Maybe I didn't even read it, you know? So, um, you know, just 
We'll work our way through it. I'm learning as we go. And everyone has been very kind, except for the couple that got stuck in my, um, in the review, because I have some words blacklisted. My God, I was telling my mother yesterday some of the comments I was giving. I wish I could do a video of reading those comments to her. First of all, my mother's not a prude. My mother knows all the dirty words. She's never been a one to swear, but my mother is not approved. Let's put it that way. We can talk about anything. And, um, and my father was like that too. We did, we, we do have a very funny family. I'll say that much. <laughs> we can say anything to each other. I could say anything to my father. I just miss him so much. Anyway, um, it was just so funny and I was, you know, just using the actual words and she's like, who said that? I mean, it was just so funny. She's like, what, what kind of people say these things? <laughs> Her expression was really, really funny, but um, I don't know. I know some of you still keep asking for her to be on camera, and I, I you know, I, I never say never. I may, you know, just get her to do it one of these days. That is it. So my plan is for later. It is. Let's see what time it is right now. For me, it is uh, almost 1:30 p.m. Eastern time. What are the time zones called in other parts of the world? Like, you know, in the United States, we have Eastern. Eastern, Central, Mountain, Pacific. What do you have in your neck of the woods? Do you have names for your time zones? Do we, do we all have the same name for the time zones? See, I don't know stuff like this. I'm not worldly at all. All right, junk drawer video coming later. It would probably be closer to tonight, I don't know. I'd like to maybe throw out a tip or something else, I don't know. All depends what I have time for, how much stamina I have, and uh, how willing you are to watch. If I still have you on board, then I'll be happy to throw stuff out at you. Thank you so much, and I will see you in a bit. Bye!